Often I've seen people, and it's my mistake as well, in the past I've gone with a fancier multi-objective model to realize that, hey, the system was broken. The, the features are incorrect and the feature pipelines were broken and, and you didn't have the right observability in. So one of my great learnings recently has been go for the science after you've done the correct engineering. Because again, right, I mean, the, the, the fancy ML model is useless if the data pipelines are, are screwed up. If you don't have the right observability, if you don't have the right feature stores, if you don't have the right data, correct data, if you're not logging all of this, if your data pipelines are stale, embeddings are stale, then the model cannot do anything. So I think like ensuring that the engineering system is correct at the scale at which you're operating and then bringing in science is important. Otherwise, it's a bit of like premature optimization. Yeah. So I think like get the right engineering team, fix the right systems, have the right observability, make sure that everything is correct. Then I would say that I deserve to work on the science problems because at least I've done the engineering right. Thanks.